Oggi stiamo costruendo un'antenna verticale per 17 metri per l'attività SOTA. Oggi bauen wir eine 17 metri verticale antenna per SOTA portabile per te. Adesso spraiamo una verticale antenna 17 metri per SOTA attivazione. Oggi noi costruiamo un'antenna filaire su 17 metri per le attivazioni SOTA. Oggi we are building a 70 metri verticale per SOTA portabile. So one of the things we have developed here whilst we've been here is the ability for people to see uh, the number of contacts we've made, the number of different modes we've been on. We've also uh, set up a little bit of a friendly rivalry between the different countries we have represented here so the delegates uh, can uh, try and make most QSOs to represent their country. That's been working really well, it's really helped enhance our QSO totals over the week. Golf Bravo 17 Yankee Oscar Tango Alpha USL, you are 5 9, it's Julius Oscar.
Alexandra, do you experience any ionizing phenomena in space that affects the wave propagation in a positive or negative way? Over. Well, Alexandra, this, uh, yes, we do this kind. We have this kind of uh, ionizing phenomena, especially the sun is uh, working there. So there are days where things uh, seem not to work uh, uh, very well, and of course our computer cameras and everything show all these ionizing uh, problems. Over. Hi, so we're uh, Harry and I'm um, uh, uh, that's Harry and I'm Dan and we're from Best Fabric Scouts. Um, uh, we were here on Tuesday talking to the uh, uh, watching the ISS contact. What we liked about it, it was uh, really uh, cool seeing one of the astronauts uh, in space and like having an opportunity to see him live. And being able to watch like the satellites adjust to the different angles and everything. Well, it was connected to the ISS. Amateur radio does seem really interesting. Yeah, I'd really love to try and get a license. I would like to try it as well and get a license and try to have a go at it as one of my hobbies. I'm Don, G3BJ, and I'm the president of uh, IARU Region 1. I'm here at uh, Gilwell Park, and I must admit I've been completely blown away by the, uh, the, the, the competence and the, the excitement which this event has generated. We've got young people here from a lot of uh, countries around uh, the region, uh, and indeed from outside the region, and uh, they're all working together in a, in a really impressive way. Uh, we have here of course the next generation of radio amateurs uh, and, and we've got to learn from what switches them on to amateur radio. First of all I've noticed that they're working very constructively across national borders to help each other get the maximum from this event and that's a truly impressive thing to see. I think for all of us, uh, particularly the older radio amateurs, we need to understand what, att that what attracted us to amateur radio in the 20th century is not what necessarily what's going to attract the youngsters of today and tomorrow to amateur radio in the 21st century. So our challenge is to make amateur radio a hobby, an activity, an exciting pastime suitable for 21st century young people and that I think is the challenge for all of us for the future. IARU Region 1 is supporting this event, has done for I think five or six years now and um, we believe that this is one way in which we can tap into uh, the ideas and resources of young people but also give them an experience about the breadth and excitement that amateur radio has to offer uh, to people of their age and of course to people of other ages as well. So this is a terrific uh, event and I'm really delighted to be here watching it all happen. Also, I'm interested uh, in doing the foundation license exam here at Yota because I find it interesting how other uh, countries and other languages uh, make their exams and how it works there. So it's really something I'm looking forward to. Yankee Oscar Tango Alpha calling CQ and listening. Is Whiskey One Alpha Whiskey calling? QSL 5 and 9, you are also 5 and 9 from Whiskey 1 Alpha Whiskey. Uh, very good morning to you. So glad the schedule worked out so easily. Uh, at the mic here is Bob Baker, Oscar Baker. Bravo, Oscar, bravo. And I'm um, uh, my home call sign is November Quebec 1 Radio. Over. Okay, Bob, yeah, very nice to make contact with you. Yeah. So you're currently joining us here at the Yota, the youngsters on the air program in the UK. We currently have over 80 people from 25 different countries, including Japan, and that's their first at the Yota for Region 3. So we've just made over 10,000 contacts here so far. 
and that's the most any Yota station has made so far. We've got Christmas Island of Australia, which was our best yet, and we've got most of the Caribbean, Central America and Indonesia. We've also got South Africa. Um, Yota so far has been really, really successful. We've had the first Yota 6 metre transatlantic contact in the FTA digital mode. Um, some people here don't have radio licences, so they've been involved on the foundation program here in the UK and have made their first contacts on the AQSL. So yeah, it's been a really good week. It's unfortunately our last full day today, but we're going to have a party this evening to celebrate the achievements throughout the whole of the week. Very nice to make contact with you over there. We'll hand it back to you for any items. Whiskey one, Bath Whiskey from Gold Bravo 17. Yankee Oscar 1017. Yankee Oscar Tango Alpha.